Okay, and, and finally, Rocco, um, you know, being the voice of Long Beach and uh, having that uh, so many people follow us, uh, I think we'd be remiss if we don't touch on uh, the tragedy that hit Long Beach this week. Um, Long Beach has really become an area, sadly, that um, heroin and drugs in general have been running rampant. And this week, we lost a 23-year-old young man to a drug overdose, and, and I just think that we should report on it, to raise awareness on it, and, and my feeling is, if anybody out there knows anyone struggling with drug abuse, do everything in your power to help that person get help. You can call uh, Long Island Crisis Center, it's available 24 hours a day, but it's something that we can't sweep under the rugs because when you hear of a, a young 23-year-old man who's got his whole life ahead of him, um, loses life to drugs, it, you know, right here in Long Beach, it really hits home. It really did. I, I mean, watching people's reactions, because I know a lot of friends that know that knew this kid, and um, you know, just seeing how heartbroken they were at his loss. You know, not only just his parents, but also people that I know that were friends of his. It, it's really very, very cool to see parents have to bury a child. It, it, it's just like the coolest kind of loss imaginable. Plus. You know, you have people that are like barely out of high school and college having to deal with burying their friend. And it, it, that's a lot to take. I mean, when you lose anybody, it's a lot to take. But, you know, you lose somebody so young, it, it really can do things to you personally. You know, I feel, I, I speak for Howie when I say our hearts go out to anybody that was affected by the loss of uh, Sam Magnolia this week. I think it's just really, really sad that this is just, this just keeps happening in, in our community, especially. And I really just hope that this, you know, it's going to be a long time before this, you know, ever hits anybody else. I think we got to really do better as a community to stay away from drugs and to really be good stewards of one another in terms of, you know, being the kind of community that we really are trying to help one another in healthy ways. And it's tough. I know that, you know, heroin is a very, very difficult thing to uh, get off of. It's very, very addicting from the moment you try it which is why nobody, I believe, should start it. And um, it, it, it's just, it's really, really sad when it, you know, especially when it's somebody that is really, really trying to rebuild their life years after they had initially um, been experimenting with it. So like I said, our hearts go out to um, the family and friends of Sam Magnoli and, you know, everybody who's been, you know, losing their battles with heroin the last, you know, year and a half and all. So hopefully, we'll be at a place where this just is not happening so f frequently as it has been. Okay, thanks for sharing, Rocco, on yes. some difficult times here in Long Beach. Yes, sir.